Tell them how you really feel. <laughs> <laughs>
See if he's pulling out. That cobalt is mean, man. That thing is running, boy. You can hear it in this quiet cab in this truck. I'm like, wow. Cold ball's running, boy. Man. I gotta say, that is a zippy little car, man. Zippy little car. And this rim, I think, you know, look, man, I think that thing ran to get really good on this truck, man. This is making me really regret not getting another ram when the Laramie deal fell through in Vegas, man. This right here is this is extra. Like this, the way it feels, like I like the trucky feel of it. I like the stiff very stiff steering and stuff in this thing i really like this man the big horn edition <laughs> and you know what these cloth seats are actually really nice you know i don't know why this dude's rolling over here on the side of the road and not in the middle of the street i don't get that he's like running like he's trying to run off the road dummy oh man well, we about to go to a little spot up here in a minute that has the best burgers. I think they, but they also might be the only burger. <laughs> they might be the only burgers in town, but they are exceptionally good, man. For frozen burgers too, man. Like, the, like I don't know how to explain it. Like this little spot, made this little country store that's been here for like 200 years is awesome. It's just so awesome, man. One of the other things I really enjoy on this is it has a Jake brake, right? So when you get off the gas, like I'll get it up to 60. When I come off the gas, the Jake brake kicks in. <laughs> it, it's almost like you don't even have to use the brakes in this truck. It's like uh, for electric car drivers, think of regenerative, regenerative, <laughs> regenerative braking. Oh, I can't talk right now. Oh. Well, we're going to get as much as we can get done today. Try to get some stuff done uh, with the Oldsmobile. I plan on having that car probably done by this upcoming Tuesday. Or, you know, put together. Then it's still going to need paint. But, you know, put together, cleaned up probably by Tuesday. And then uh, it'll be ready to be given away. You know, we can start the giveaway video while it's going in the paint. So I'm, I'm looking forward to that. Definitely looking forward to that. That Jake break, boy. I can't. I can't, I can't keep up with him. I got this thing to the floor, man. Jesus Christ. You can hear the turbo in this thing just and just like it can't catch him, man. I can't catch him. That little that little cobalt is a beast, man. Damn. Mm-mm-mm. Supposedly they said we may get some tornadoes out here today and some uh, golf ball size hail. So we're going to have to hope that that doesn't happen. But uh yeah. I guess we got <laughs> I guess we I guess we're going to see, huh? I guess we're about to find out. Mm. All right. So we are almost getting up here to AAR headquarters. Should be meeting up with uh, Austin Carr. I guess he's got some friends that are coming to help cut down a tree. But it doesn't look like they're here yet. There's the Oldsmobile. Oh. 
<laughs> Little thing, man. Okay. Yeah. Oh man, well we're up here at David Stanley Dodge. I remember coming here to buy a Hellcat, but they couldn't get me one. I ended up having to go somewhere else. We see they got one now, so I don't know. We'll see if Randy's going to scoop one up. Good morning, bums. <laughs> oh. It's shower time, man. It's time to get a move on, get things going today. Yes, it's the next day. Yeah. Hmm, waiting for that coffee, boy. So today, this thing is leaking? Word? All right. So today, all of that, and I only got this little bit of coffee. What kind of shit is this? Um, today, we're heading to Dallas. Well, actually, I got to go to a couple places in Texas. More on that later. But yeah, today, we're popping down to Dallas for, wow, it's like, uh oh, I know what it is. Let me hold this L. My bad. Look at this, man. See, fellas, you know when the ladies be saying we don't follow instructions? That's what this is. I did not have the top thing on it, so watch this. Now it's going to fill with coffee. I feel like a dumbass. Pay me no mind. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm just giving trolls free fodder. Like, they're just, they're just going to be like, damn, man. Damn. Well, if you're going to troll, you know, I appreciate everybody that's, that has clicked the uh, join button here on the channel. I really appreciate that. Uh, but true trolls will go subscribe to my OnlyFans. <laughs> I kid, I kid. <laughs> Who else has been on social media and seen a bazillion OnlyFans accounts? Like, people be like, yo, shit's tough right now. You know, the girl down the street with six kids. Subscribe to my OnlyFans. Oh, come on, man. Damn, even the coffee cup is like, hold this L. Let me just turn this shit off. Man, I'm making a mess. I'm over here destroying stuff. <sighs> See, this is what happens when you get up and you don't have your coffee ready. See, when I'm at home, I got that thing on. Just It's automated. I get up in the morning, and it's like a Folgers commercial, man. You know, fresh, what is it? <laughs> The best part of waking up is Folgers in your cup. Except it's not Folgers. It's uh, Dunkin' Donuts. <sighs> what does it sound like in a building? Can I hear it all the way in here? Let's see. Yeah. Listen to that. You can hear that rumble all the way in here. Damn. <laughs> Oh, you rat! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
you snitching <laughs> notification, man. So we're moving, man. Um, we are going to be making our way down to Texas today. Um, some business and other stuff I need to take care of down in the uh, Dallas slash Plano area. So we're going to head that way here in a second. Uh, I got my coffee on deck. Still got the coffee there, you know. And you can see all the other coffee cups and trash on my floorboard over there. I do clean it out when I get fuel, which I kind of slacked. I got gas here the other day and I didn't do it, but yeah. Oh boy. So let's see if I can not miss the split this time. So I need to stay. All right. I need to stay here. You know, because the map last time when I was trying to get to the hotel, like it, it, it gave, it set me for a loop, man. All right, so this is a yield. Yo, the yield things out here in Oklahoma too are bugged out, man. They'll be having like double yields and stuff, man. It's crazy. Don't make no damn sense. It just takes a little bit of getting used to. Similar to uh, like if you're in Texas with the loop de loops on I-35 and stuff, you know, with the turnarounds, man. All right, so we're moving. We'll uh, keep the progress going as we go. I know this video has kind of been a little bit all over the place. You know, we went to AAR headquarters a couple times, took care of a couple of different things. And this is kind of more, you know, vlog style with you guys. Just letting you guys go along with my couple of days here. And y'all can see some of the stuff that's going on. But uh, I think you guys are going to enjoy the uh, the uh, BMW that we're picking up down here in Dallas. I think you guys will, will find that uh, pretty, pretty freaking cool. I know y'all want to hear me sing, but I ain't doing it, though. All right, let me stop. <laughs> so, shout out to the washing machine at the damn hotel that destroyed my t-shirts. So, now I got to pick up some t-shirts and I don't think I'm gonna be able to find any here huh I know everybody's gonna buy up all the damn t-shirts man now some of y'all are gonna say damn TK you look mad young today what did you do well no homo I uh I've been using some of this cool new stuff I'm not gonna drop a link to it I ain't promoting it yet but I did get to use it and uh, look at my skin, man. I'm out here looking like I'm a fat 20. <laughs> Anyways, we're on our way. Uh, I had to stop at Walmart to pick up some t-shirts because, you know, my t-shirts were just destroyed in the uh, washing machine, which I know some of y'all would be like, yay. I'm a t-shirt dude, man. I wear t-shirts all the time. I just, I don't, I mean, I, I used to wear suits every day, okay? And I, that part of my life is over, man. I don't want to do that anymore. Damn, snitching, snitching truck, man. Anyways, we're on the way. We gotta get, uh, we gotta get down to Texas, and um, you know, pick up this BMW and do a couple other things. So, let's uh, get into it. Funny story as we get started, though, right? Um, we got back to the house earlier. <laughs> it was yesterday, right? And um, at Randy's, and. I rolled the windows down with the key in the Tahoe and I, I had a bag, you know, uh, of broccoli, uh, like just raw cut broccoli in like a Ziploc bag that I was eating and snacking on, uh, which you may have seen in like a previous video. I left it in the car. It got hot. When I rolled the windows down, you know, like I laugh and I joke all the time. We talk about Bedussi and whatever. This was on next level rank. Like it smelled like if Randy's in the premiere, he's going to let you know. It smelled like straight farts, bro. Straight farts. At least I don't have anybody hanging out the back of the pickup in this one. Last time I was in Oklahoma, they had like, this chick was like hang leg hanging out the truck. Man. But yeah, uh, it smelled like straight. If you know what I'm talking about, like those broccoli farts, bro. <laughs> I know y'all like, yeah, we went from talking about cars to talking about farts. Yes, man. Yeah, man, it was bad. 
And then the smell stayed. Like I had to like, I put, I broke out the Armor All, uh, black ice, uh, air freshener. I had to do it. I had to do it because, and then leave it in here and hope it got hot to like kill the smell because, yo, the smell was, was next level nasty, man. It was just like, uh, you know what I'm saying? It was crazy. But anywho's, um, we are on our way. We are running down here to uh, Texas. Oh, I see the police coming. You never know if it's the police down here. I think with that kind of light bar, though, that's the cops. Because you got, like, road workers down here with red and blue lights. I I've never seen no shit like that. Actually, no. I I've seen it. I forgot about it. When I lived in Austin, they had yellow and red or yellow and blue or something. But I don't understand that at all. That's crazy. Well, now that I've uh, ruined all y'all's meals today talking about broccoli farts, <laughs> let's get into it. normally do uh integrations or things like that but when it's companies or stuff I, I really like or stuff i really use um or eat or things like that then i like to promote my friends man and um today today's video is brought to you by doing the world of flavor that's right i said it doing the world of flavor.com aka popcorn world shout out to my dude uh, LeBaron. If you haven't checked it out yet, listen, man. Before y'all say, man, popcorn, listen, bro. I Listen, I haven't made no more orders because I'm trying to not be fat boy fabulous. I'm, I'm trying to get back, bro. Some of y'all remember me when I was jacked. I'm trying. I'm not trying to get back to, to you know, juice head status. I'm just trying to get back to not looking like I'm from the King of Queens, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to not look like Kevin James, bro. You know what I'm saying? But... If you are on some, I don't care. I'm at home. I'm stuck. I need something tasty. Go check. Go check out my dude LeBaron's uh, website, uh, DoingTheWorldOfFlavor.com. Maybe I'll even do some like boss ass animation right here too. But go check him out. Oh man, we're moving. Look at these clouds out here, man. Some of these clouds look way so. You know, being in Florida off and on. You know, like being in Miami. You know having the clubs and stuff there you know you get there during storm season and you see like crazy clouds right but seeing this right here like the clouds this is this is florida is nothing like the crazy clouds you see in texas and oklahoma man it's wild out here man like i don't i don't get it i don't know how y'all live out here where where like and it, it could be nice and just raining and they tell you it's just rain today in the forecast and then the next thing you know, boom, the whole sky opens up and it's hold this hell, you know? Tornadoes, you know, spooling up everywhere. So, I did learn something about tornadoes, though. If you see, like, you see how the cows is all out here and they're just chilling on their own, right? They're all spread out, laying down, eating. Some of them are smashing. You know what I'm saying? Then everything is okay, man. But when you start seeing all them damn cows all together in one spot, by like a fence or the corner of a fence or whatever and they're all huddled up something's about something bad's about to happen <laughs> something bad is about to happen you know well welcome to texas we are in the building shout out to texas i'm gonna get off over here i see a bunch of cops and a bunch of ambulances coming across the border that's weird huh Alright, so we're looking for the tourist info or the rest area. So that's what we're looking for now. It's coming up. Yo, know, the road conditions, I got big all-terrain tires, so I'm able to go through this water pretty easily. 75. Oh, I love the speed limits in Texas, man. 75. But look, man, 
here's the thing. Um, I'm watching people lose it. I watched somebody go in the ditch, another one in a forerunner run down. It's been crazy, man. Uh, I do gotta get, I am hitting the rest area. I gotta feed, man. Fuck this. Uh, but I'm, I'm just like, wow, man. The rain is really starting to come down. Damn it, man. Yeah, see, look at the play. You see the play in my steering wheel? That's the front tires literally just skidding. Skidding all this crap. It's crazy. <coughs> this is crazy. All right, now let's see if I hit the brakes of a hydroplane. A little bit. <laughs> You gotta be easy, man. See, people freak out. They start to slide a little bit when you hit the brakes or you hit some water and they immediately like jerk the wheel and that's 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 when you screw up, man. You jerk that wheel too hard and it's night night for you, man. You're all done at that point. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Slow down, slow down. Now I'm on some concrete. Autos, RVs, and coaches this way. All right. We're at the Texas Welcome Center, baby. Woo! Look at Bertha getting out that Denali HD, boy. I'm about to get my ass wet, too. But <laughs> she's running. She got one hand over her head, like, that's not gonna help you with your head, dude, sweetheart. You're gonna have to hold that L. You just gotta get out and just deal with it. Just take it. Cause it's gonna happen, like I'm about to do right now. I'm about to get out and just take it. Y'all think I'm playing? I'm about to run like a bitch. <laughs> oh. Damn it, man. I ain't running nothing. Oh. Whew. Whoa, boy, boy. I'm gonna walk back to the truck. Hmm. That rain, boy. That rain ain't no pump. Ah, oh. shit is coming down sideways, man. Woo! <coughs> and we got to use the hand sanitizer immediately. Oh, wipe all this water down. I know y'all say I'm being anal, man, but uh. Watch me get demonetized for saying ain't hey, no. Um, I just don't like having water spots all over my interior. I'm just ain't no like that, man. And yes, I know I need an oil change. We'll be doing that when we get back. Oh. We are, oh, I can't see really on the camera. Is that a curb? Yeah, it is. I think I'm good though. All right, we are in there like swimwear and we are back on the road. Da, 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 da. Man, it is raining out here, boy. Man. All right, guys, we're still rolling here into Texas. I got about 30 minutes left to go. And it looks like we have a, a wreck or something up here. I see the, the police cars in the ditch. Oh, whoa, 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 move, man. Dumbass just came to a complete stop in the road. Oh, wow. That do, that F-150 was smashed. This dumbass right here, did you see that Prius, man? He was just like, a, just gonna just stop. Just stop in the middle of the freaking road, man. Go by slow. You can't change lanes. And you go by slow. Man, I hate dumbass drivers, man. Oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> Yo. Was that karma just, just spraying me in the face? Telling me to shut up? <laughs> yeah. But for real, though, man. Oh, this is like ice pellets. Oh, crap. This better not be hail, man. 
Oh. oh, we're passing the University of North Texas at the G Stadium, man. The rain, the water is like pooling up in the roads. I've just watched another person in an Infinity FX just eat it. I, didn't have, I wish I had the camera up. I need to probably just mount it and just let it run on the dash, man. But you see me, the speed limit is 75, and I'm going under 55 with everybody else. Because you could be running here at 70 or 80 and hit one of these dips under the bridge and there's a pool of water. You know, you end up going through like little lakes. It's crazy, man. That's just bad civil engineering. You know, I'm not I'm not taking any shots at Texas specifically, but their their municipalities are spending dumb money with dumb civil engineers that are making dumb designs. Oh, well, you can see here we're going through. There's a you see Fort Worth Drive. We're right outside of uh, Dallas at this point, so we should be in here shortly. I'm gonna focus on driving so I can keep both hands on the wheel, and uh, I'll be back with you guys here in a minute. Look how the water is just pulled up too, man. Crazy, man. Crazy. I'm moving a little quicker now. Look at the water. Look at this water in the road. Oh, 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 wow. You see, I'm getting squirrely. <laughs> Woo! Yeah. And you know you're in Texas when you see all these flyovers, man. You get these in Dallas, you get them in Austin, definitely get them in Houston. Like, just these bridges, these high ass bridges everywhere. You all, you flying over everything, man. It's crazy. Crazy crazy oh there we go man we're on George W. Bush or George Bush tollway parkway and look dang, dang, dang. another one bites the dust spun around and hit that barrier baby oh man coming soon to Copart uh 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 This one right here looks like it flipped. Oh, it did, it flipped. Wow. So we got my dude here, Carl, from Snail Cases and a multitude of other case companies on Amazon. And this is his brand new butter, Tesla Model X. This is the 100D too, right? Uh, it's 100D, though, it's 2017. It's a 2017 100D. Look at this. This thing is a boss. This thing is a boss. Carl came up on this one. Oh, he got <laughs> See, now Carl is flexing right now. He's out here. He's just opening up the windows and shit. He's like, yo. <laughs> You're going to try to close the doors? <laughs> yo. Because it's cold. Bro. Oh, okay. He's like, because it's cold. We can, we can step in the front row. can take a screen, take some drive, man. And see, what's crazy is... You have all the automated uh, drive. Well, I don't know if it will automate from the back seat, but look at how butter. This is a good. You did good with this, bro. <laughs> you got the Alcantara ceiling and everything. You're straight. You came up on this one. All right, guys. So this this car right here, you, we, we both got masks on. Though. Like this car right here is butter. So uh, where can they find you on YouTube? Uh, it's, I got a small channel, Homeless Call, but it's kind <laughs> of my personal hobby channel yeah because so carl is not a, a normal youtuber right so he does like he comes from the, from the tech world so i know him from like manufacturing cases all kinds of other stuff so um wallets uh like if you've ever seen like those ridge wallets those are a ripoff he's been doing that shit way before um any of that stuff so um you still making those uh small one small one a small wallet so you know this is the one. Look, look, see, he got the he got another one already. See, I already know. Keys, coins, card, cash, and <laughs> one of these. But Yo. I'm trying to put it on the Kickstarter right now. Oh, that's what's up. That's what's up. So I'm gonna put a link to his channel in the description. <laughs> I need y'all to go subscribe. Go check out his shit. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, it's not gonna be you're not gonna be disappointed. Especially like <laughs> 
Him when he him. goes right. live, when he goes live or we go live, man, oh man, the savagery that ensues, like it's fun times. If you like to see me do dumb shit when I go live, I promise you, you'll love to see him do dumb shit when he goes live. I promise, it's fun times. But um, yo, congratulations on you with the Tesla, bro. You over here, you over here winning. And you got kids coming and everything. But see, this is not the bitch family mobile. This is not like a fucking Honda Odyssey. This is the smart way to have the family. He can still put the kids in here. He got space right here to he keep got them. got a six seat. You got another seat back there. Two seat back there. So this is a good family video that is not pussy, okay? Which means when he comes up to the light, if you were in a Honda Civic and you're sitting there revving that shit with a fart can, he's going to embarrass you with that shit. So don't <laughs> do it. So <laughs> so Carl is... Uh, got, see, I told you Carl's crazy. He got a lot of balls. He's like... TK, do you want to drive the Tesla? And I was like, yeah, sure. <laughs> like, who's going to turn? It's raining. It's wet. And we have, like, an insane amount of horsepower. Of course. It was just fun times. But no, we'll just take... I just want to see if it has the same pull that the uh, the 100D car has. Which I think it does. Come on, little piece of shit, Sentra. <laughs> All right. Have you ever driven this thing yet? Have you really got on it? Who, me? Yeah. I drove, this is my second time driving. Okay, so hold on, let me show you. All right, here we go, guys. <laughs> yo, Carl, yo, I can hear Carl, Carl's like, Carl nervously <laughs> laughing, but he's like, oh shit. <laughs> shit this thing, zero to 60, you'll, like that, I don't care. X5, M5, M3, dude, you will crush them in this car. So just so you guys know, the Tesla, like there's nothing like an electric car. Like the this the instant pickup when you get on it is ridiculous. It it it's unlike anything you'll ever drive in your life. So if you're looking for something that's ridiculous, get a Tesla. And you can get them fairly cheap. I mean I think Carl paid 100 k for this one, but did I miss the turn? Oh I did. It doesn't connect, does it? Nope. All right. Ooh. But you can find used Teslas now. Like even the even the low battery options, like the 75D and the uh I think I think they made a 60 back in the day too. Oh y'all got y'all's hatch open? What the hell y'all doing? Oh they got shit sticking out of it. Nice. Well here now I can show you I get to show you the mamba too. Yeah, you gotta tint it. Yeah, I I, I agree. I agree. I think the tinting would make this thing look sick. Cause you got the the back is tinted good you just got to put like 35 or whatever on the front and Especially the windshield yeah yeah, yeah. up top yeah if you do it up here oh shit i forgot that the window goes all the way up yeah if you start if you did it like blacked out from like here up yeah it'd make a huge difference also i need to black out i need to black out all the cones Oh, you want to wrap it? Change. Yeah, 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 yeah. I need to change the wheel as well. I want to do things like yours. So if you do, he's talking about the mom. If you do, if you, um, you could powder coat your rims and they paint them black, right? Yeah. Then they look good. Or you can, uh, and, and as far as the chrome, they can do the wrap. They yeah. can do a vinyl wrap on it. That thing looks, this thing looks crazy, man. Well, guys, like I said, again, if you see, if you want to check out his channel, I'm going to put a link to his channel in the description. Go check it out. Um, I highly recommend it. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm recently started. It's just like a personal hobby, man. I follow my brother to be a YouTuber anyway. <laughs> you guys are gonna, gonna get a ball like shit, man. <laughs> All right, so major shout out to my dude, Carl, from Snail Cases and stuff, man. Like I said, I'm gonna put a link to his channel in the description. He ain't have to do this, man. This is this is an excessive birthday gift, man. Yeah, out here giving, up, giving out $1,500 phones. He balling, man. You gotta respect that, man. I gotta respect his hustle, man. I'm trying to show y'all his Tesla. I got to respect his hustle, man. You know? That's my brother, though. I will tell you that. He's like family to me, man. We've known each other for years. And this dude is like... This dude is legit like family. <laughs> but there's his Tesla. We're going to roll out. 